first and foremost guys really quick i am this close to 20,000 subscribers on the second channel link is down below let's make it happen yesterday on the channel i opened a ton of packs and the pack opening started horrendously but then we had some really good luck in the back end and we had enough stubs to get a bunch of collections done we broke down every division that i had left to do and what stubs we had and the different things we could potentially do and you guys kind of agreed with me in the comment section on that video we're gonna do the nl west and the al east we're gonna get both collections done today and i'm gonna debut the 96 mike musina in rank season i've already been putting bio orders in galore before i even started this video so i could speed up the intro so let me finish up these collections and then we'll play already done the giants now i just need to lock in the or i've already done the dodgers now i just need to lock in the giants we just had our buy order on brandon crawford go through as i'm sitting here doing this so there's willie mccovey done. now the padres i had already picked up tatis because i wanted to play with him day one we only needed machado that's gonna unlock tony gwynn the 93 gonna throw him in the lineup for this game the colorado rockies there's only one gold in their lineup which is crazy to me cj crone is a savage gold larry walk now the arizona diamondbacks is gonna finish up the nl west and that's gonna unlock the 85 over all brandon webb we're gonna see a better version of brandon webb later in the year that could potentially be nasty now that the nl west is done we're gonna take all five of these collection rewards lock them in for the 96 overall kenley jansen all-star card 2017 100 hits per nine eel fast tinker cutter slider he'll be in the bullpen for us now the al east the hard part was vladdy he took a huge chunk out of our stubs he pretty much the albert Pujols pull and i sold my matt carpenter diamond card from the headliners that's how i got vladimir guerrero jr and i just picked up everyone else we needed and tom hankey is the 91 diamond reward for the blue jays next up the tampa bay rays we have two more cards that we need to pick up i'm just gonna go ahead and grab shane mcclanahan and Kevin Kiermeyer will bless some buy orders here and get this done. Lock those guys in. This is one of the collection rewards that I'm probably, I may have already uploaded last night's No Money Spent video unlocking this Jose Alvarado. I need to get this done, No Money Spent ASAP. This is one of the first collections that you should do. Let him help you on your first ranked seasons run. The Baltimore Orioles, the other easy team in the AL East. All we need is John Means. Bless another buy order here just to get that done. Hang. 82 overall, Darren O'Day. And then the Yankees, last but not least, we have all of these cards. We pulled Aaron Judge in the pack opening yesterday. I just had to grab Garrett Cole. Gary Sanchez, 89 overall, second half, 2017 diamond, 96, 111 power. He's gonna go behind the plate for us today. Now that the AL East is done, we'll lock all these cards in for the 96 overall, Mike Musina. Haven't started the NL Central at all. Done two out of five on the AL Central for that in 93 overall, Grady Sizemore. And then the AL West is the hardest one because of Trout and Otani, and you only get a 96 overall, Michael Young. Had to do this today. I've been wanting to use that Mike Musina card so bad. His hits per nine is not great. It's the one part of the card that concerns me. So I want to get this debut done sooner than later. All right, throw him for us. Like I said, Mike Musina going to be on the mound. We have the Tom Hinky, Jose Alvarado, and Kenley Jansen cards added to our bullpen. And our lineup for this one is going to be Tony Gwynn, Mike Trout, Chase Sutley, Fernando Tatis Jr., Ryan Howard, Vladdy Guerrero Jr., Kirk Gibson, and Gary Sanchez. Vladdy in a secondary over third base. I just really want to swing it with him. Going to be using with him on pack squads moving forward. Be on the lookout for the next video. He'll be debuting in pack squad soon. Joe Mauer is my catcher and that's not going to change, but I got to get Gary a debut. It simply needs to happen. If we face a lefty, he's going yard. up 90 to 95 real tight par on that pitch that's not where you want it though got a bad drop down on that Let's see what the cutter looks like that sinker leaking and him night to not grabbing it could work to our advantage good hold take that nando he rolled it over one down it's oh and two on javi bias i'll throw a slider away from him here popped it up Pop him up! The big piece! Two down! Good sinker. He fought it off. It'll be 0-2 though. We are ahead. That's exactly what we want from that pitch. Let's go to the back foot slider. Better. Starting to get my timing down on that pull down. It's getting closer. Not perfect yet. There we go. 
Nasty. Three up, three down for Mike Musina in his debut. Let's get this man immediate run support. Tony Gwynn, get down. No. Tony Gwynn starts the game with a line out to right. Trouty in. Good at bat there. Two back to back good change ups once he got to a two strike count, too. Get through. No. Beat that out, Trout. <laughs> Devers with a diving stop at third. Nice play. That ball was hit 92 when he was up on the grass. Nice play. Get through. No. Worst swing of the inning. All right. We let him get ahead of us there. Maybe be a little bit more aggressive. Fastballs and sinkers. He wants to try and get ahead of us. I'm going to be a little bit more aggressive in the second inning. He had good at-bats there. We had a couple good PCIs. But first pitch curveball, and he drops one out to right. It always just happens like that. Aaron Judge gets sawed off. Got him. Whew. Out of the hand, I thought that was hanging. That was a good slider. Musina's got great break on his pitches. Three, six, one. Bang! Nice play! Had a boy Tatis. He's got a cannon. And he's going to lead off the bottom half. Take advantage of that. Whew. Let Buxton get on. Whenever I give up leadoff singles like that, those bleeders and weak hits, it's always someone with 99 speed. Tatus chops that changeup. I got to let. Oh, he, he booted it. He booted it. I'll take that. I got to stop chasing that changeup, though. That's twice now. Two at bats in a row. Ryan Howard, that ball seared through the hole. Hey, just like him, we have two on. Nobody out here in the second inning. No, oh, I wanted to be early so bad. Timing was great. I just didn't get it. I just didn't get it. I knew exactly what pitch I was getting to. Dang it. I got to barrel that up. Kurt Gibson in. I pushed my PCI in. I didn't see the sinker spin until it was too late. Back to back outs here. I've got to clutch up. Gary? No. I got on top. He's spamming that sinker in righty righty though. I'm eventually going to barrel one up. He's got to score soon, because the way he's repeating his mixes, it's only a matter of time. That one lifted to left. Goose! It's a good sinker right there. We're 0-2. Break a bat. Good pitch. Got him! Beautiful! Four Ks here in the third. Back-to-back -back strikeouts after the double. One and two. That curveball has so much break, it's nuts. Good slider. He went. Ring him. Oh, it's three, two. Ah, beautiful. Ma. Too close to take. He thought I front doored him. That was ball four, but not by much. Get out there. Get out there. That's a tough play. That's a tough play. Ah, almost. Tony Gwynn! Lines out the short. Just didn't hit it. Uh-oh. Tony, I need you to just squeeze that for me, sir. Thank you. That's his best swing of the game. Taking off with Buxton. It's not a perfect throw. I think I may have gotten him with a perfect throw. Single's going to score Buxton. Oh, my gosh. It sneaks by Musina, and it is a one nothing ball game. And there's a two ball. A little 3-6-3 three, three to end the inning, but he gets one. Takes advantage. Buxton on. Steals a bag and in. I always give up the singles to the 99 speed guys. Chase! There's a leadoff knock. I'm still on top of this sinker, man. He's not throwing any four seams at all. I got to make an adjustment here. Nando! All over it! Deep out to left, gone! Give me that run back, and one. We win the frame, and there's still nobody out. Fernando Tatis, bang! <laughs> I'm so happy that went out. It almost didn't. Late side of good. Oh, Ryan. Still chasing that changeup, too. I'm on top of the sinker, I'm chasing the changeup. My two flaws here against AJ Burnett. Oh, I got under that changeup. That thing jumped off Ryan Howard's bat. First out of the fourth. Vladdy? The shift might give us two bags here. It will. It's going to get down. Aaron Judge couldn't get there. 
Vladdy will get to second standing. Kirk Gibson flies out to left. Get through now. I can't stop chasing the changeup. Pen going here just in case. We'll do Classe and Alvarado. I'm gonna save Jansen for the ninth if we can if we need it. I'll chase one. Thank you. Four, six, three, bang! Bop, 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 bop! Look at Chase on the Utah. This middle infield is just. I dreamed of this middle infield in Diamond Dynasty. Cronenworth coming off the bench now. So there goes AJ Burnett. Well, let's, let's see what's going on in this man's bullpen here. He's got Chapman and Kerry Wood warmed up. That is the 92 Aroldis Chapman. So I'm assuming that's facing the franchise paralleled up a few times. He's going to his best arms right away. He's got a good bullpen though, all energied up. So uh, AJ Burnett was the worst arm we were gonna see. We've got to step our game up. That is a nasty pitch when you get that on the black like that. It's gross. Ground ball to second. Good timing on that swing, but he was well on top. Whew. I need an insurance run ASAP. Yo, Mike Musina just went lefty lefty on Chapman. <laughs> on down with Tony Gwynn. Move that runner up to second. Oh, and Tony Gwynn wins the foot race. That worked out all around. Chase, Utley, I'm sending everybody. I'm sending everybody. I'm sending everybody. <laughs> Chase, RBI single and we advance on the throw. It's second to third, one out, up two now. We can run away from him here. One big swing. Nando, that's a hard hit ground ball. It's an RBI, drives in another one. Utley will move up to third. Oh my gosh, Ryan. That is not a terrible swing at all. It's just a little off the end of the PCI. And we strand one. We add two. We're up three. Good curveball. I need that down there. Way down there. He's been poking the one just out of the zone, out the center. Nice! Back-to-back -back strikeouts! This is the second time this game Musina suddenly turned into a strikeout machine right when we needed him to. Aaron Judge is two for two with an RBI in this game. Let me get an aggressive first swing out of him. Nice! A one, exactly what we wanted. I feel like I'm reading this guy well. And even on his hits, he's mostly a single guy here so far. Hits are 8-8. Eight, eight. Oh, that's a great take. That's a good take on his part, big time. Good cutter. Poof. That thing's basically a slider. Freezing. Or don't. Tatis. Ah. Lead off knock for Devers. Uh oh. He might not make it out of this frame. Yes. Dude, Ryan Howard is out here turning two like it's nothing today. Big double play. Every time we get runners on, it's double plays and strikeouts. Put them away. Swing and that ball smashed on a line. Attaboy, Tony! Saves him by seven frames from Mike Musina. One run on nine hits. I'd say six or seven of the hits were pretty soft contact. Got some swings out of the zone. My opponents had some good PCIs on pitches just off the plate, so I gotta give him some credit too. But Musina was great in this game. He even had a single and scored a run last time up. But we are gonna go ahead and hit Stu Miguel Cabrera here. Get up, ball. Just under that slider. Chapman's tired here. We've got to jump on him. He's trying to steal a third inning and preserve his bullpen. Tony Gwynn just on top of that slider. Hit pretty hard right at the shortstop, Carlos Correa. Oh, Trout. That ball is annihilated. Right on the corner of that slider, though. Hasn't given us much to hit here. That was a hittable ball, and we got it. Two out knock for Trout extends the seventh. No! No! I didn't get my PCI down there. Chapman gets through a whole extra frame. I can't let him believe I just let him do that. Nine hits apiece. We go to the eighth up three. Up for his debut, throwing flame. Two down. Tatis is so tall. 
That wasn't a good pitch to throw Javi Baez, but it's three up, three down for Jose Alvarado on six pitches. And Tatis leading it off. We'll see Ryan Howard and Vlad. Boo, bro. Come on, guys. Don't do this. Asked for me to wipe your record. Boo! Musina, my goodness. Seven innings, eight Ks. Got the dub. 1.29 ERA going into his next one. Next God Squad debut is either going to be a pitcher from a collection or we're going to be thrown with Otani and it'll be a position player debut. We will uh, cross that bridge when we get there. Do you want to see me debut next? And definitely let me know how I should go about the collections next. Trout's most likely going to be the last guy I get since I haven't pulled him yet this year. Not going to be able to do it that way. He's going to have to be the last dude I get. Until then, I'm going to be doing debuts of everyone else in the collections that you want to see leading up to the end. I'm not debuting all of them, but the good ones. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.